It is race day here in Des Moines, Iowa. Super stoked, got in pretty late last night, just chilling, slept amazingly. Body's a little tight, but ready. Um, we just had breakfast. We're gonna do some RPR, so essential nervous system reset, using tools that we use every day to get us ready for speed. And then we're also gonna prime the glutes. So today I've got the Hunter breaststroke. Um, which is a very glute driven stroke like my dad is saying and we're gonna go into my power dot app real quick here power dot um, I've got these placed on my glute here, so It's kind of right on the cheek there and the idea is It'll send a a little bit of an electrical stimulation throughout the glute. I'm going to focus on a warm-up slash potentiation glutes, glutes hip and then this is gonna go for five minutes, fire it up. And then while that's happening, my dad's going to do some central nervous system reset on, there we go. Super painful soft. But you'll see here, it like twitches a little bit. So that's basically what's happened. Okay. And attaches and oxygenate your body, get a 30% increase in performance would be crazy. But over time, it'll be better and better and better. And, and, and to be honest, a big thing is it's not deep breaths, eh? Deep breaths are really bad. So while we're breathing, it's just mouth closed. Mouth closed and just breathe. But don't breathe big. In and out of don't the nose. Don't breathe big. It's because if just you relax. breathe big, you lose carbon dioxide. So, so just relax. Just relax. Breathing breathing breathing. Just relax very softly. So you actually can't even tell you're breathing. And because the problem is if you breathe big, you expel carbon dioxide. So you follow the carbon dioxide to open up the diaphragm. And you know the diaphragm sucks in. Doing the pin actually helps to release the glutes. Put a pin somewhere. Put oh. it in the back of your head. So what Dad was saying there is because you wouldn't have heard the chin activates the glute. Like that. The Super so the idea behind central nervous system reset is that there's pressure points or there's points along the body that connect to major muscle groups. So like chin, back of the head activates and releases the glutes, um, sternum, uh, rib cage. What are those? Uh, shoulder release. Like shoulder release. Rib, um, ribs releases the um, diaphragm. Helps the diaphragm, so, helps the diaphragm so you breathe. Inside so, the legs. A lot of interesting things, but After we're gonna get ready to head to the pool. I'm not gonna shave my face this morning. I shaved my legs and everything else last night. And I'll shave my face for finals tonight. Um, like I said earlier, 100 breaststroke, super stoked, fired up, ready to go. Yeah. We're a little behind schedule. What's the time now, Dad? It's 8.40ish. In the view. So it's about 8.40, meet starts at 9.30, 100 breaststroke at 10. So not a lot of time to warm up. It's about a five minute walk to the pool. I think we could actually see it from here. No, it's on the other side of the building. But we'll get there. Hey, which way would we walk? Um, I have no idea. I think it'd be this one. Is it, if we're walking towards the swimming pool, the YMCA the Aquatic Center? Um, I think that's on 6th Avenue, right? Um, maybe. Possibly. Yeah, I could pull it up on maps. Um, I think it's this way. Right oh, perfect. Check, okay. yeah. Thank you. 
lost in Iowa. I, feel like we're walking the I, way. I think we're walking the right way. I don't know. Let me find out. Do you know what the here, YMCA of Greater? It's 900 feet away. 900 feet? Are we walking yeah. in the right direction for the YMCA? The no. Swimming pool? Okay. Uh, I told them. <laughs> it's, it's okay. The gentleman that was helping us is pretty cool. Okay. Speaking just about the the plan going forward this year and stuff, and and the the fear factor that coronavirus has been throwing on the Olympics, which is pretty gnarly on whether the Olympic Games will be postponed or even potentially canceled because of the coronavirus. I don't think it will be. I'm pretty certain it won't be canceled. Um, but if it is postponed, it's got to be done within this calendar year. No, they, they can postpone it, but it, but but it has to be done trained. in 2020. Everybody's trained for that period to be done. It's crazy. But they're canceling meets in Tokyo because of this. Yeah, but, those, so. but there's other meets that are still qualifying meets. Yeah. But look, see, this is cool, guys. We just like don't even walk on the street. You just cross through the buildings. Pretty nuts. What was the team name? Race Base, Race Base Club. Club. Okay, yeah. see you, Katie. Hey. Yeah? I'm going to grab a coffee. Okay. And then um, what's the time? We're at 9.30. Yeah. 9.30, 10 is the okay. thingy. I'm going to get a coffee. Get a coffee. Okay. And I'll get you out there. So jump in. Sounds good. Cool, see you in a bit. Crazy. Thank you. Thank you. Hey Mike, what's up? So we're here in the warm up, warm down pool. I'm gonna head over and get into the comp pool quickly before it closes for warm ups and then get ready for the 100 breaths. Quick heater shot, 100 breaths is about 20 minutes. Stoked, ready to go. Warm ups are fast, feeling ready. So uh, let's do it. Fired up. Ryan Lochte's in the water for free. We are gonna head back. Hey, my man, what's up? For free? Yep. Man, this morning was solid. 100 breast stroke, I went 59.8. Didn't film anything, just because it was kind of in a rush. I think I've got a video clip from a friend that I can put up here. You see, he's got power, he's, he's getting stronger. Oh, he's gonna be, he's gonna be a 59. Get in. 59. But man, probably the easiest 100 breaststroke I've ever swum. So I was out 27.7, back 32.0. It's really quick. That's like your 50 times. Well, my 50 times 26.8. Yeah, but yeah, 27 sevens for 100 is quick. So that was really nice. So I'm really excited for tonight. See what we can do. Sharpen it up. Foot got a little tight coming back. So the tempo and the kick changed. And I think I wasn't closing the gap quite as nicely. And uh, I think mean, we'll just take a bunch of salt and make sure that the feet stay nice and primed for tonight but I'm fired up we're just gonna head to the room and we'll I'll show you through a bit of what I do to recover and get ready for finals my glutes have been a little tighter than usual um, partly from like a shoot we did the, last, the other week and so I'm just gonna take my lacrosse ball and roll underneath the glutes and just try to put all my weight down on it that way I uh, can just loosen it up favorite part of the meet. Woo! Actually, it's like my favorite part's the racing, but I love some sleep. What is up? We're all awake. Lights. 
ready to go. Amazing sleep, got two hours and 20 minutes. So now I'm going to shave up the face and get nice and smooth for a night. Super fast, 59.1 PB. I'll tell you guys more in a bit, but I'm gonna go and get a massage and get ready. And we've got media. I got them. <laughs> and then we've got uh, media with Swim Swam, and then we're gonna head out and uh, have dinner and get ready for tomorrow. A quick interview with Swim Swam, my man Coleman. Yeah. Which you guys can actually check the link down in the bio. Uh, you guys can watch the interview. Probably gonna go over some cool stuff, being Olympic year, being coronavirus. <laughs> A lot of things to talk about. I'm with media, with Swim Swam. Love talking to them, my favorite people. But we're gonna head and do autograph sessions. So I'm got, we're gonna be doing it with Tate, and we got Olivia Smaliga, I think. Oh, you're talking about going up there? Oh, no, she went to get snacks. She's oh, over there. Snacks. Oh, I should grab some more snacks. I'm gonna grab something on our way. Tate and I are gonna set up a thing. Well, we're Tate's gonna, gonna set up. Him yeah. While we play, while I carry him in Fortnite. Exactly. So you, you play PC? I do play okay, PC. Okay, so yeah. I've started playing PlayStation 4. You guys know I used to play Xbox, but we're gonna... I do have PlayStation 4, I should friend you on that really? too. Oh, actually. that'd be yeah. sick. That'd be way good. Yeah, we can squat up, get a bunch of swimmers, do a live stream. Let me know if you guys would be interested in something like that, because Tate can hook us up. It's real easy, it's just rotate up. The Rowdy Gaines. The man behind the voice. And then over here we've got Liz Bible. Amazing. I gotta try to say hi to her. What's up? I gotta give you a hug real quick. Good job, Swans. Yo, you did awesome. You. Thank you so much. I'm stoked on your book. Huh? Pep talk in the lobby. I came to one earlier. That's what I'm saying. That's why I swam fast. I know. Oh, I'm in the middle, baby. <laughs> That one better be for me, dude. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. Oh, you have hi. a favorite vlog? I don't want to sign this. Too many. I like, I like all your morning ones. All the morning ones? Yeah. Appreciate it. Potato. What's up, man? Smashed it. Oh yeah. Let's go. Solid autograph session. You know, they're all here for my uh, for my <laughs> Fortnite skills and. Exactly. I shouldn't even preach that. I should really be preaching my Apex skills because I'm not actually good at Fortnite. Definitely. Yeah. <laughs> I'm definitely better at Apex. Regardless, <laughs> stay tuned, guys. I'll link his Twitch yeah. down below. Yeah, we'll some fun and stuff. then uh, yeah, we'll try link up and we'll do some fun gaming good, stuff. Good content. Like why not? I'm sure people would love to see me just get yeah. creamed. <laughs> see ya. We're back home, training well, life is amazing, super stoked, just kind of recapping off of oh, the whole weekend, was really great to swim a 59-100 breaststroke, 51-3, fly was good, but not super fast, I think there's a little more room for improvement, still a PB, so happy with that, 
And then the big one was the 200 IM, which I didn't film any of this on the second and third day, but uh, I went a 156.8, which puts me sixth fastest American all time, number four in the world this year. So very, 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 very happy with where that puts me. Um, and a lot of room to improve. But what I was thinking is, would you guys be interested if I did a full race analysis of specific races in my career, whether it be this past weekend or races from world champs or whatever, and told you basically what I see wrong and the things that I see right and how I can maybe get better from that. So leave a comment down below if that's something you guys are interested in because I think that could be pretty fun. And then next week, I actually get to head to Houston and spend some time with my girlfriend and her family, which I'm super stoked about. Probably go do some top golf, and you guys will see that in a vlog, potentially. Um, but yeah, life is good. Feeling blessed, swimming fast, um, discovering new things as we train every day. But I hope you guys enjoy this content. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe. Love you guys. Cheers. Have a good one. Bye.